Hello, I'm Nick Cusick. I'm the CEO and original co-founder of Bison Inc. of Lincoln, Nebraska. If that sounds a little bit like a segment of the Shark Tank, uh, maybe it's because uh, that's one of my favorite shows and I watch that on TV and I've always uh, admired uh, entrepreneurs who uh, start from nothing and build a business and certainly that's uh, the history of Bison. Uh, our roots of uh, having started our business in 1974, my business partner and I were each 23. A gentleman by the name of Elmer Russell, we'd met uh, my first day of school at uh, the local high school. We became uh, friends, ultimately became business partners, and uh, we remained friends and uh, business partners uh, for almost 40 years until we separated our multiple business entities uh, in uh, 2014 and uh, kind of each went our own way, but we remained uh, friends until his death this last year. And uh, we've been privately held with the same ownership structure since the beginning. And uh, I think that serves us well. I think it serves our customers and our, and our dealers well to have commonality of philosophy, commonality of goals, commonality of vision. Here at Bison, our marketing tagline is a goal for every game. Uh, basically, that's what we make. We don't make balls, we don't make uh, uniforms, we don't make shoes. What we make is quality, durable equipment that's meant to last uh, virtually a, a lifetime. Certainly at Bison, we, we recognize that safety in youth sports and in all sports is a, is a critical component. Uh, it's critical not only for player safety itself and for the players themselves, but uh, also for liability for facilities. Uh, so uh, many of our innovations have come in the area of safety. You know, we were the first to invent or uh, to bring to the marketplace high-end residential basketball systems. We were the first to come up with a affordable yet durable breakaway goal for competition use at a time when most high schools uh, back in the 80s did not have breakaway uh, goals. And we came out with a, a goal that was not only durable but also very affordable and it really broadened the scope of breakaway goals uh, at high schools and even below high schools in gymnasiums. Uh, we were the first to bring out and we invented a DuraSkin backboard padding, which uh, uh, is the standard today for backboard safety padding, both for durability and for uh, protection of uh, players uh, when they contact a the backboard. We were the first to bring out a carbon fiber volleyball pole uh, making a lightweight yet stiff and durable volleyball pole uh, possible. Um, we were the first to come out with a truly totally portable volleyball system to use in arenas or places where there was not volleyball sockets. Had no cables, had no loose ballast. Uh, it was all uh, totally freestanding with built-in ballast. Um, and the list goes on and on. So we, you know, we, we, we pride ourselves in innovation we strive to be competitive in the marketplace and uh, believe that we certainly are so. And our growth over the number of years that we've been in business uh, certainly, certainly shows that. And so again, we're, we're manufacturers first, uh, and I think that's why we uh, have a strong history of making affordable, durable, innovative, and cost-effective products. Yes, I can do that for you. What's your account number? One of the hallmarks of Bison's um, history is staying in connection with our with our customer base. We still believe that hard copy catalogs, uh, postcards, and snail mail is still a good way to communicate uh, with our customers uh, and with our vendors. So we continue to, to uh, work a lot of ways, a lot of different angles to communicate. One is that we have for almost 20 years published a quarterly Bison newsletter. It goes out to everybody who wants to be on the list. It goes out to all of our dealers across the country. It goes out to all their staff, all the team salespeople, uh, and it's certainly available for anyone who wants to subscribe. Another aspect of communication certainly is um, always listening to the customers, always listening to our dealers, always listening to coaches. Uh, whether we get good news on our product and compliments on our product or whether we get uh, critical input, we always take that seriously. Many of our uh, safety uh, features have come from input from our dealers and from our customers. Uh, it's, not un, 
it's not unheard of to have a coach uh, send us an email and saying, hey, have you ever thought of? And uh, we take that very seriously and many of our best uh, innovations have come from our, uh, our customers themselves. So uh, uh, we want to continue to work with dealers and our customers to, to always make it right. So if our staff is not able to satisfy a customer, occasionally it gets to me. And the first question I always ask is, what, what, can, what can we do to make it right? Our, our philosophy, our inventory philosophy, our sales philosophy is that on any standard item, uh, like a breakaway rim or backboard padding or pole system or any of those types of products that we sell or volleyball system, we strive to have them in stock so we're not building per order. We're certainly building, uh, building for inventory to satisfy customers' needs. We know that when a, a school orders something, they expect to get it. Uh, when a dealer makes the sale, they expect to have it ship. And particularly in today's uh, environment with online sales and all that, people are used to, uh, they're kind of instantaneous consumers. They want stuff immediately. And we recognize that. So we work hard to uh, invest in the inventory that it, that it takes to satisfy those needs. Here at Bison, we're very relationship driven. And our growth and our success is largely based on the relationships we build with our customers, uh, with our dealers, the culture here at, at, at Bison has always been one of innovation, of respect for employees. Our 100 employees in Lincoln, Nebraska, uh, many of them have been with us uh, 20 or 30 years. And we intend to be here another 40, 50 years. Uh, and with your help, with your partnering, with your uh, ongoing relationship with our entire staff, uh, with your input, uh, and sometimes with your forgiveness for any flaws that we might have. Uh, we will be here uh, for you and for the industry uh, well into the future. So again, we want to thank all of our uh, dealers, all of our customers for all these years in the success that you've helped us create, in the safety we've helped create in the marketplace, in the innovative products that we've worked together to bring to the market uh, for the good of, of youth, high school and college sports. So uh, thank you again for your efforts.